What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Shield Nuzlocke, and like I said in the last episode, we were going to start off this episode with our Wild Encounter to see if it's something we want to add, and it's a Kingler. Um, I don't think I have a Krabby, so I think it's fair game to catch a Kingler. But, I don't know, I'm kind of tired of like the water Pokemon I get. I already have like two water Pokemon on my team, so maybe let's not catch that. <laughs> I'll just take the I'll just take the L on that one. But at least we can kind of get squeeze caught up. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, it's been a minute since I recorded a Nuzlocke video, and that was simply just because I had to travel for work. So now that I'm back, I'm able to record because I have my PC and all that stuff. Um. I'm like wondering, I'm like, I'm like I taught, I taught these guys uh, Brick Break. No, you have Brick Break, but maybe I'll just put Bougie Queen out there. Babite. <laughs> that didn't sound like Babite. Yes, let's teach these ruffians a lesson. Uh, let's see. I'm kind of thrown off that I like no dragon pulse. I don't know, maybe poison gas Venoshock. <laughs> it works out that we outspeed the line line too as well. yourself from the poison kind of wondering if been a shock would have just like one hit KO'd it already or if it's just because I poisoned it and got that double damage on it that did the trick <laughs> Pangoro uh yeah I had a feeling it was the evolution We'll just poison gas and uh, venom shock again. If it doesn't like one hit, K. Okay. okay, use taunt. Sweet. Wasted your turn, bro. Also, another update is that I started uh, the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Deluxe uh, playthrough on my channel. If you haven't checked it out, please do. Um, I would say, like, who I chose or who I was assigned to as, like, my starter. But I feel like you guys will just enjoy it better if you just watch it yourself and see how I answer the questions to get who I got. <laughs> So this is where we actually get the ability to ride our bike on the water now, which is really convenient. I think I'm about to switch uh, Nikki back to being out front, just because we know Discharge, and Discharge would be like a pretty good way to make quick work of all the water Pokemon we'll encounter. I don't know why I went all the way like that. <laughs> oh man. That's one thing I don't like about the water is like all the Pokemon that can start flying up <laughs> at you. Which 
I in no way want to have happen. Ooh, excuse me. Just battle these trainers, get that good old EXP. Let's go, Jacob. I feel like when I first like played through here, I feel like this cloister put in work. I can't remember. I don't know. Every time I see a cloister now, I just instantly assume it's going to put in work. Oh, and we, uh, O-code it. It's funny seeing Squeeze so far behind, especially being that I don't have any, uh, any EXP candies, sadly. Yeah, there was a trainer there. I thought so. I don't even know if this area counts as like an area I can catch Pokemon at. It's still a part of Route 9, isn't it? Or if it's showing as like a whole separate section, does that, does that get to count? I think so. Because then you're just like really limited on the areas in which you can catch if the route is like a huge, a huge, huge route that you just do your first encounter on like as soon as you get there. Who are you sending out? Oh wow. Can't do counter on a special attack. This isn't, this isn't the one that, yep, it is the one that, that like throws up when it dies and hurts you. Oh, you want to learn takedown, huh? Let's uh, heal up just to, just to be safe. I don't want to just end up going out here and something just demolishing me. Yeah, no, this is still on the same route. But they give us like Route 9 like three times, so... I don't know, I guess I'm looking at it like, why would you... Why would you give us Route 9 three times and have us limit ourselves in a Nuzlocke? I'm kind of wondering what that item was over there. I don't know if I really want to full out go get it like that, but I might just have to. Maybe I should have stockpiled first. <laughs> just because he's really trying to beef up his sock just to try to destroy me. <laughs> Oh wow, yeah, that did a good amount. As long as it wasn't a crit, that's all I care about. And then now I'm wondering, like, who would I send out to? Because that's... Now that I lost, uh... Sir Pex, it's... It's like, now I need something for a fighting type Pokemon. I don't have a psychic type on the team, which I probably should have added. Um... Instead of Squeeze. So, I, I don't know, I might end up switching Squeeze out for a psychic type Pokemon. 
because uh yeah when i'm looking at everything we have there's nothing that's going to be super effective against these guys psychic or fighting move um and i don't know i have a feeling that he just knows a dark type move but i don't know it's a risk i'm willing to take right now i can't remember if it was the physical attack or the special attack that throw was or defense i mean but let's see that never misses but we can get a stab just from being the same typing yeah okay that did a good amount yeah why would you use a fighting move on me bro what is you thinking I don't remember what levels Squeeze will evolve at, but I think the, the sooner the better for us. Ooh, almost, almost got caught by that one. What is this? Rock slide. Oh, wow. That'd be pretty good to know, um, except that's only really useful against uh against like the oh did not want to fight you that's only really useful against uh flying and bug types and i have something for flying types and i have something for bug types Ooh, i was about to say if they didn't let me run and they let it just like take out nikki i would have been so upset i'm like why y'all gotta do me like that Up a trainer. I gotta fight these trainers because it's pretty good EXP. She says she has a toxic pack. Yep, toxic pack. Oh, she has it in the dive ball, I believe. So we're just gonna do our good old discharge. I remember how OP Toxapex was when it first like was introduced into the Pokemon game for Sun and Moon. And everybody in their mama was using the Toxapex. Including me. Okay, now it says Outer Spike Myth, so this counts as like a whole new route that I can catch someone on now. I think. <laughs> oh, I did not want it to be you. Uh... I'm gonna, I'm gonna see about capturing this one just because I'm I can't remember if I caught uh its first form or not. If I caught its first form, then I'll just release it and do another wild encounter. I just can't remember if I caught its first form because I'm not catching evolutions of it. Yeah, use nasty plot all you want. Didn't I buy Ultra Balls? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> and we got another Dark type Pokemon. I've never really been a fan of this Pokemon. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of like a Perugly, uh, or Perugly reject. 
or want to be. Uh, okay, yeah, no. That counted as our, our capture and our encounter. We don't have the first form for it. Oh, man. Neo, teardrops, Zelda. <laughs> oh, scoplands, okay. Wow. Well, I'm glad you weren't my encounter. I feel like I probably should have just like ran. <laughs> Fury swipes. Okay, you don't do that much. Okay, but you had to hit all five times. What is my solution to dark type Pokemon? Because I know we have the the fight coming up with Ah, oh, look at that. Squeeze is evolving. 27. I don't know why that seems like such an odd level to to have a uh a stuff will evolve into beware. But now we're are we normal fighting? Yep. <laughs> learn bind. <laughs> you don't want to learn the other fighting moves though, buddy? I guess I'll have to teach you Brick Break myself. Yeah, we'll get rid of payback. <laughs> I'm like, just let me just be sure I don't have any EXP. Can how much? How many rare candies do I have? Though I have five. Uh, I could use all this rare candy on him just to get you closer in level. Yep, I need to definitely go do some raids. Oh man, I'm just like thinking like, who do I want to start off with? Uh... I don't know, I think I might start off with, with Bougie Queen. That might be our best bet. I like how she just like whispers it from the side. Hey, Blades, like, hey, hey, aw, oh, man. Hey, hey, you, like, come over here. I'm not being creepy or weird or anything. It would have been nice to have my wild encounter be a clavipus. What up, girl? Yeah, let's go, Marnie. Your team's level is... Forty two, okay. And you outspeed my bougie queen. Oh, it's fine. You you wasted your you wasted like your whole two turns with that.
Phantom Force. Okay. Yeah, we'll get rid of Shadow Punch for that. <laughs> Just because that sounds pretty badass. Scrafty. Um, which is Dark Fighting. Yeah, we don't have anything to, to take out either. Oh, a bug type. That's definitely what I could have got. I could have got a bug type. <laughs> Oh, well, the bug type I have is... The bug type I have is Psychic, so... Dang, you're really just gonna slow me down like that, bro? Oh, you know, shit's... Wow, I just wasted a whole turn. <laughs> but that's good to know her scrappy as shed skin for those that didn't know I guess it's because I'm so used to I'm so used to having a moxie uh, so used to having a moxie scrafty Of course, you use a hyper potion. How much will Crunch do? Ooh, Crunch did a little too much to my liking. So we are switching into into Shimmy Sham. <laughs> Front shouldn't do that much to Shimmy Sham. And it did. Wow. Oh, you couldn't have just t took him out, Shimmy Sham? That would have been the perfect, like, time to <laughs> just one hit KO it on that switch in. Uh, just use Giga Drain again, just because I know Hydro Pump will just have like a higher chance of missing, and that's dead. We don't we don't need that. <laughs> no, we don't need Iron Defense on you. Toxic Croak? Uh... I think this is like our best answer to Toxic Croak. Even though Toxic Croak might be faster and hit hard. If it gets off like a dark type move. Uh, hopefully we live it. Just so we can get Stomping Tantrum off. Oh, you s Okay. Oh, you miss Clutch. So darn Clutch. <laughs> now send out your, uh... Your wannabe Pikachu. <laughs> yeah, there we go. More Pico. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I still don't forgive you for taking out an important uh, member on my team. Yeah, that was for Zelda. <laughs> Look at that, squeeze up to 33. And we're getting a hell of money. Is that 10,000 Poké Dollars? I like how nobody like knows about this entrance on this side though.
But guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. We made it to Spike Myth, and uh, next episode we're going to be challenging the gym leader, uh, doing the gym challenge for that, and hopefully we don't lose any important people along the way. But with that said, guys, make sure you like the video. It helps out the video a lot, and also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. With that said, stay sharp. Later.